Dear parishioners of St. Rose, this is Father Leo checking in. I hope you're healthy and are doing well. So during these past two months, I've been wrestling with certain questions, as I'm sure many of you have. Questions such as, how can God allow this pandemic to occur? Not only that, but how can God allow circumstances where His people cannot enter the church in order to participate in the Mass and receive Holy Communion? Why is God allowing these things to happen? There's one important distinction we have to make when dealing with such naturally occurring questions. And that's that such questions do not point to a crisis of faith, but rather towards a crisis of understanding. The struggle to understand God's ways, especially in moments of crisis, have been something believers have experienced for millennia. So anyone familiar with the Old Testament knows of the many times the Israelites asked such questions during the times when all seemed lost and that God had abandoned His people. And yet we also know that during such difficult times for God's people, it was the opposite that was true. Through God's divine providence, the Israelites were given special opportunities to turn back to God. Opportunities to abandon false idols and false senses of securities. Opportunities to put all their trust and hope in God. Thousands of years ago, these lessons were not easy to learn, but ones that were sorely needed. Imagine a caring mother or father watching their child work on a difficult school assignment. It's obvious that the child is struggling during the process to complete the work, and yet the parent allows the child to go through the difficult experience in order for him or her to grow and to learn. It's not easy for the child, but a lesson that he or she has to learn. Dear friends, it's not easy to understand God's ways. But thank God that we are not called to understand them, at least not completely. In the end, we are called to be faithful, as God is faithful. We're reminded of God's faithfulness and love for us in today's Gospel reading when Jesus says that we are His sheep and that no one can take take us out of His hand. This means that nothing can take us away from Him, not even COVID-19. God was, is, and will always be faithful. Let's use the opportunities COVID-19 has given us wisely to grow in faith, hope, and love.